You always want to clean your clippers and clipper blades after using them for two reasons. One, so you don't spread funk around, and two, you're going to preserve the life of your clippers and blades. Horses can get various and sundry skin infections like mud fever and rain rot and even ringworm, and those are all uh, communicable diseases, and they can get passed to other horses with saddle pads and girths and brushing and also with clipper blades. And incidentally, ringworm, that nice fungal infection, can also be transmitted to people. And by cleaning them after you use them, you are going to help preserve the life of that clipper blade. You're gonna keep the blade sharp, you're gonna keep everything oiled, and you're not gonna let moisture kind of take hold and let rust settle in. And this is really easy to do. All you have to do is brush out the hair from your clipper blade, take it, a, take it off the clipper body, clean out that area, and then you can use a spray sanitizer. And just a couple of squirts of this, let it sit for about two minutes, and then wipe it off. And then add your clipper oil and they're ready for storage or use on another horse. And for the love of all things horse, let's not use kerosene to wash our clipper blades anymore. Today's metals and combination of metals that create the modern clipper blade get damaged by using kerosene. And also who wants that stuff around their horses? Yuck.